Alright folks, what's going on? Welcome to another exciting episode of the Andrew 26101 show. Now, listen. <laughs> One of my favorite trolls in the world, Mrs. AKA Miss Elite Penny Quarter Pounder, weighing in an astonishing weight of 365 pounds of jelly fat. She loves to call me fat, but at the end of the day, I'm gonna show you exactly what this quarter pounder bitch looks like. But let's look at the title for itself. Andrew666. Ooh, ooh, Illuminati in this bitch. Let's go. Hook's got to go overseas due to being unattractive. Thanks for my attention. Wow. Now listen, those of y'all who don't know who Penny Brewster, Penny quarter pounder with extra lettuce tomatoes and sauce and cheese and all types of shit one big tons of loving 100 percent beef those of y'all who don't know who quarter pounder penny is man this chick basically is an oversized whale that stop that you're hurting my feelings a lot of black youtubers okay she targets men to go she targets uh red pillars and anybody who does traveling i call her Mrs. Kim123, because that's basically what it is. In other words, she's a female black feminist who's a pro advocate against any man who travels, including white men who travel. But for the most part, she singly handles attacking older black men. And this is what her channel is basically all about. This is what I talk about, man. These Looney Tune weird oddball mother effers that's on YouTube and do nothing all day but troll. Well, since I've got time on my hands and I'm quarantining this bitch, why not? So anyways, she got the title called Andrew 666. Let's go ahead and hear what she's got to say. So as I always usually do, I'll do my commentary, <laughs> my beautiful commentary. And I'll also give you my honest opinion what I think of this subject and matter. Let's go ahead and play. Okay. Oh my God, y'all. I just had like three cans of Mountain Dew. Aries is in another state right now. Yes, she is. Three cans of Mountain Dew. Hmm. Well, okay. You know, Miss Cotton Candy. I'm not going to say which state she's in. Because you know, she's got friends by the name of Cotton Candy. Mountain Dew, Cotton Candy. This bitch thinks about food all the time. This is why I call her Penny Quarter Pounder. <laughs> you know what I find so funny about this chick is that she loves to criticize about my weight. And I say to myself, well, wait a minute. I am nowhere near being fat. Not at all. I am like a muscular fat a little bit, but you know. You know, your boys, you know, turn, toning up, you know what I'm saying? Losing those extra calories. <laughs> Getting back in shape. But anyways, let's continue. I don't want everybody to get, oh my God, oh my God, don't worry about what state she's in. <laughs> oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I had three Mountain Dews and I said, I am not going to wait. Because the area she's in, the reception sucks. Okay? There's lots of... I guess she's talking about her lesbian lover. You know, <laughs> since she doesn't like men. In particular, that's what it kind of comes off as being. But anyways. Let's keep on playing. Quarter pounder. Extra cheese. Lettuce, tomatoes. And some sauce. You know, woods nearby. You know, she sees Mike. Tell him I said hi. But, um... I said, if she wants to do this, she's going to have to come to my place with my technology and my decent reception, everything, because I'm not doing a link thing. I'm done with links. I have no interest in links. I don't, I don't care about it. I just... I thought this video was about me. This is when it became about Mountain Dews. <laughs> Next man, she's going to talk about Twinkies. <laughs> Oh boy, all right, let's get to the good stuff, man. Nine minutes and 21 seconds left of this video. I just don't. I don't. So anyway, someone sent me the link to this guy named Andrew666. First of all, that's not my name, bitch. My name is Andrew26101 Show. By the way, Andrew26101 Show. If you really want to feel Satan's wrath, I can really show you the demons of hell. <laughs> and nobody sent you this link because you've got many accounts many troll accounts that's been trolling my show and everything that i've stated in here penny quarter pounder aka miss elite aka um mrs whale promotes on youtube black man bashing videos and that's the truth 
Now, it's not the fact that you do Batman bashing videos. Well, that is part of it because I am part of the black race. But it's the fact that you troll me. I've deleted your account so many times. And that's all you do is come on here. And I've seen it in live screaming chats. All she does is talks about my weight. Oh, you're so ugly. Oh, you're this. Oh, you're that. I don't understand with these mofos. I don't get it. It's like if you don't like somebody so much, then why do you keep trolling them? You go on my live stream, woman, and that's all you continuously do is troll me. Oh, you're fat. Uh, uh, uh. But you still watch my videos. I find it so ironically funny she wants that a baby. person who's as big as my goddamn door what the fuck? has a nerve to call me fat when your ass, your body is shaped like a goddamn quarter pounder, bitch. You got me fucked up. Let's keep playing. I have not been on his page in a very long time. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Ooh, oh my god. Stop fucking lying. You're lying. You're lying. I just saw you the other day. This little, oh my god. Good god. This woman was just on my page the other day, man. Damn it, I wish I would have saved those files and those screenshots of her being on my live stream. The only reason why you're not on my live stream right now, bitch, is because I blocked you from God knows to oblivion and beyond. I blocked you from non-existence. That's why you're not on my page anymore, because I'm tired of you trolling my page. Because this is what you do. You're nothing more than a female chem. I can't really say you're a white supremacist, but you are part of the black woman feminist agenda. You're a black feminist. So, of course, I, like I told you before with this nut job named Kim, okay? He aligns himself with black feminists. He aligns with himself with anybody who hates black men, who do videos on trying to destroy the image of black men. And this is what Mrs. Penny Quarter Pound is all about. She's all about trying to troll and destroy the image of black men. But let's continue. And I was like, oh, the, the, the munchkin from Oz. I remember him and his... Yeah, munchkin from Oz. But yet still, your ass is shaped like a damn well. We're going to go ahead <laughs> after this fucking video. I'm going to dedicate this song just for Mr. M well, Mr. Yeah, Mr. Penny Quarter Pounder. Eh, might as well be. His little meaty face and I got to go overseas because I'm so un... First of all, I never talk about I got to go overseas. That's your boyfriend, or I should say your girlfriend, Kim. You guys probably go to Macy's together, shop in Bloomingdale's as well, try on each other's dresses. Hey, Kim, what do you, what do you, think, I look? you think I look fat in this dress? Penny quarter bound his old big 245 sumo looking ass going up to Kim. Kim, do I look fat in this dress? Oh, no, girl, you look very nice. I'm pretty sure we can attract a lot of BBCs. This woman right here, man. Good God. Get it together, Kim. Or Pen. Whatever the fuck. I'm calling you Ken now, man. Most of you, all you motherfuckers are the same. Bunch of weirdos. Unattractive and no one wants me here. You know, I, I remember him. Uh, no, I, I, I've never talked about that in none of my videos that I'm not attractive. First of all, a lot of women find me very much attractive. I don't know what is up with these Looney Tune motherfuckers. I've had women who subscribe to my channel find me very attractive. It's only you oddball motherfuckers, which I don't really care about, because your body is shaped like a damn quarter pounder. You know, we're we going we go to get to the fat well in just a second. Let's keep playing. I remember him, and like everyone else, he is also spreading rumors about me. I'm spreading rumors about you? What the fuck? You think I got time to be spreading rumors about you? For what? Like, wow. Spreading rumors about you. What is there to spread about you? Mrs. Quarter Pounder. What type of rumors is there to spread around you? And nobody has sent you this video. You just log in and out from different accounts. And like a weirdo, you subscribe to my channel. And like the weirdo that you are, you make a video saying, Somebody sent me this video. You're just like your goddamn girlfriend, Kim. Y'all both the same. Somebody sent me this video. Ain't nobody send you shit. Ain't nobody checking for you, bitch. With 82 views. Get the fuck, get the fuck out of here. Five likes and four thumbs down. And you can tell this ain't for me because I ain't thumbs down your shit. Look at that. Get the fuck out of here. You full of shit. Okay, 
Okay, see, I didn't even know he was actually having a live about me and others. And I'm like, huh? Uh-huh. No, I will not be sharing that live link. <laughs> but, you know, I... You will not be sharing my live link. Okay. As if you have a lot of followers, bitch. You know what I'm saying? I got over 2,000 followers before I even did my second YouTube channel. I had over 20,000 subscribers. This is the type of jealousy that I deal with on the internet, folks. If it's not coming from these weird, oddball, racist Hispanics that's on YouTube who have problems with black men who travel... I'm dealing with these radical self-hatred black feminists. And I never said black women in a whole. I'm talking about black feminists, women such as herself. If you don't believe me, let's go ahead and take a look at, at, at her page real quick. Just to give you guys a little glimpse of the type of content that she does. Okay, now you can see she goes by Miss Elite. Okay, she went by a lot of penny pounder, quarter pounder, whatever the fuck. But I'm just going to... Just give you a little glimpse of her videos, man. Like, the whole blog at this place. I don't want to get, eh, hold on, fuck that. Okay, so majority of her videos, as you can see, are targeting black men in particular. Okay, Let, let's go to the videos real quick. Let's go to her videos. Look at all her videos, okay? Most of her videos are targeting black men. And Big Tao and Red Pill, Okay. Majority, this is what, I'm not going to go to all this stuff, but this is, this is the content that this woman puts out. Nothing original, just a bunch of trolling, trolling at its finest. Now, I can understand, man. I can understand that we are in times right now where everybody's quarantined. And this is what I talk about, the quarantine trolls. Penny Brewster, Punky Brewster, whatever the fuck. I'm trying to not get monetized for that shit, but anyways, um, this chick basically, man, like I said, she's on YouTube to do solely nothing more than to destroy the black man's image, just like him. Racist advocates. Except for her, she's a black woman, so you can't really put her as being racist, just black male bashing. She's a basher. I mean, this, what can she honestly say that I'm not telling the truth? The, tr- the proof is in the pudding. It's in the pudding. You don't like Meg Tao. You don't like red pills. And you're a black man basher. So what is it that I'm lying about, woman? Tell me what it is that I'm lying about. Everything that I've talked about is the truth. As far as me being unattractive, that's on your opinion, which I don't really give two shits about because your body's shaped like a whale and I wouldn't even touch you with my friend's dick if I had it attached to me. I wouldn't even fuck you with his shit. You ugly ass, man. Get the fuck out of here. This is the type of weirdos that I deal with. Talk about I'm fat. Bitch, I'm nowhere near being fat. Just a little bit thick, you know what I'm saying? But God damn it, girl. You got some issues, man. Get off a nigga dick. Three cans of Mountain Dew. Aries is in another state right now. Okay, I don't give a fuck about Aries or Mars or Jupiter or planet, Neptune or Uranus. Let's go ahead and skip this shit, man. Oh my god, oh my god, don't worry about what state she's in. All right, she's talking about some bullshit. I mean, no, sorry. All right, let's get back over here because I, I I went a little bit too far in there. My, my bad. Let's go ahead and play. Fuck this shit. My crew, you know, I I guess he misses us or something. No, nah. obviously he's a low key fan. This is his way of crying. I'm not a low key fan. I'm just kind of tired of you trolling me. Man. It's you that's trolling me. Cray, See, cray. a lot of these trolls think that I don't know it's them, but I have ways of finding out who they are. I know that she trolls me with multiple accounts. That's why I blocked her ass. I have a way of finding out. I'm not gonna. I I just showed you guys a clip of one of a uh, person that was hating on me in one of my videos that thumbs down my premiere. And I even show you the proof that they were trolling me from the last video. This person says, "Well, I wouldn't listen to a guy like him. This is a waste of my time." But yet still, she's waiting for the next video to pop up. <laughs> I find this hysterical, but let's keep on playing. Quarter pounder, whale ass. I'm for help. He, he needs my services again. Oh. He needs someone to 
communicate with him again. Oh. Not, he has nothing and he has nobody besides his, I don't know, his overseas friend. I don't know what part of the prostitution city or whatever he met her at. I don't know. I don't oh, so now you want, now, okay, my overseas friend prostitution. First of all, that is my fiance. That's not my friend. And that is a woman of grace, not a prostitute. But thanks for you so much for sharing that wonderful jealousy information. But see, this is what I talk about, folks. This is the jealousy of these type of idiots. That's on YouTube. This is the type of trolls that I get. She subscribed to my channel. She subscribed to my channel, but I blocked her. I'm not going to go into trying to figure it, find out and show you guys proof and all that other shit. Because that's just a little bit too much. I can't get into too much because I'm not going to waste too much time on this. It's already 15 minutes into this video, man. But listen. This is the shit that I'm talking about here, man. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. These weirdos on the internet. They subscribe to your channel just to troll. Somebody gave me this video. Nobody gave you this video. His video is up on the public demand. You just so happen to be subscribed to my channel with a fake account. And you got in your feelings. Oh, poor, 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 poor. And she goes into fat shaming me. God damn, how can a fat person try to call another person fat? Have you seen yourself, bitch? Have you looked in the mirror? Oh, that's right. It cracked before you even got the chance to glance. I get it. I understand. I don't know. I don't know. And I see he's still supporting his little fake cut. Nothing wrong with fake cuts, but me, when I have my future children, obviously one of them is going to be a boy. What? My son, he has to grow his hair. Fake uh, cuts? There's other styles. Fake cuts? What are you talking about? What the hell is a fake cut? Bitch, do you see what I have on in the video? I got a hat on. Fake cuts? This is why I wear my mask on, because you motherfuckers is contagious. Contagious. I'm quarantined, bitch. Quarantine all day. I'm staying away from you. Oh, my God. You guys are contagious. Fake cuts. What is a fake cut? Can somebody answer that? What is a fake cut? else out there besides the same duplicate hairstyle. What? But, you know, good for those who have that hairstyle, regardless of your gender. It's just... If you can grow it, have fun with it. You know what I mean? What? No, I don't know what you yeah, mean. I had three Mountain Dews, so I don't want to wait for it. Yeah, bitch, you're drinking way too much Mountain Dews. Way too much Mountain Dews. You don't even know what the hell you're talking about. First she goes from... Like, I'm even confused now. I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. What the hell? You see, food and drinks is on this quarter pounder's mind, and she doesn't even know what the hell she's talking about. Mm, yeah. This guy going overseas, beating whatever girl, that whatever friend, prostitution, da 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 You see, this right here, Dominicans should really find this woman very offensive, because now she is, is putting the whole country of women into this prostitution ring. Because honestly, if I was a Dominican woman, I would feel very offended. Because not all Dominican women are prostitutes. I think that's just very highly offensive. But... Seemingly, this is coming from a fat, overweight African American woman who's a whale, who's very unattractive. This is what she results into: name bashing and name calling. Andrew six six six. Hmm. Nobody for any roasting. I don't want to roast one. I don't want to roast two. Roast? I want to roast a minimum, maybe four or five of them. Really? I want to go wild. No, you're not. Until this caffeine leaves my system. Wow. So the little munchkin from Oz, the original Oz, the first one, you know, with his little meaty face. Does this make any sense? This is why I'm doing a dumb video, because I'm responding to a dumb idiot. I'm responding to somebody who's an idiot. You're supposed to talk about why you probably feel offended by this video and you want to make a comeback. But see, she has no substance whatsoever because everything that I put out here on this platform talking about Mrs. Quarter Pounder is the absolute truth. She can't even roast me. The first thing she's talking about is Mountain Dew and drinking and eating shit. Good God, you fat bitch. Do something better with
with yourself. Besides attacking me on Mountain Dew. This doesn't make any sense, man. Bitch, you need to come harder than that. This is retarded. I don't, I can't, I don't even know how to respond to this. I can't respond to this yet. She calls me Munchkin. Aw. I've been told I was Munchkin, too, because I had those cute little fat little cheeks. I got a baby face, and women love that shit. Okay? What about men? What do men love about you? They can roll your ass inside of a back of a seat of a trunk or some shit. Probably. Yeah. I don't know, man. This, this is just weird, man. I can't even I can't even properly respond to this, man. I guess if I was Mountain Dew, man, I'd feel more offended, man, because this big fat whale is talking about a product that I probably doesn't even want to belong or want to be attached to whales or quarter pounders. You know what I'm saying? Bitch. She's a big old, big old fat bitch. She goes to Ryan's and they say shit. This one's gonna cost us. She's a big old bitch. Mmm, she's a big old bitch. She sweats quits. You could hide a pound of dope under one of her tits. Big fat bitch. Big old old bitch. Who stole Christmas? The Grinch. Who stole the Twinkies? Big fat bitch. She's a big old bitch. Yeah, she had this Cajun friend who had a pet alligator. She ate that some bitch like it was a green now and later. Or a fried green tomato. You'd have to have a turbo foaming car wash brush to masturbate her. She's a big old bitch. She's a big old bitch. Yeah, when she was eight years old, she had a pogo stick that would say, Hey, Wanda. And they'd go, song, tong, tong, song, tong, tong. And now her pogo stick says, Holy fucking shit. And they go, bow. Bow. <laughs> She's a big old bitch. She's a big old, oh, 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 bitch. Yeah, she gurgles and drools and spits And she makes all kinds of noise She chases the ice cream man down Cunningham In her corduroy she goes She's a big old bitch She's a big old Big fat bitch